Hello everybody, Sif again with another Beast Breaker run. And today I will be continuing the story. <laughs> uh, let's go and see what the story has to say. Moats, preserve me, this young Lord Dandelion. I appreciate this enthusiasm, but you're all putting yourselves in real danger out there. I don't think he really understands that. Or, frankly, much of anything. <laughs> Oh, good morning. I have just taken a turn about the grounds to of your rustic estate to snub a few pictures. I trust you don't mind. It is simply that your topiaries were arranged in such daring naturistic shapes. Uh -uh. However, I was interrupted by one of your unconditional messenger pins. Oh, they're called pins? A, a pin? You recognize them? Certainly, though it is shockingly advanced, more so than any I've seen, it is clearly a pin. That's an acronym, of course, for perfect, no practical. Uh, mm, uh, yeah, I don't remember. I myself have a, a relay pin synced to my lapel pin for processing. Oh, that's what this is. Okay, and communicating vital information, and also for taking selfies. Regardless, this clearly means that whoever is making and sending these pins is a fellow noble. Ho ho ho, a noble ho ho ho. <laughs> After all, between the Collegium and the Queen, technology is always advancing past the cutting edge. Though, in my opinion, that was already quite evident from the natural inclination to help others, <laughs> if you say so. Okay, can I craft anything? Nothing to be crafted. This means everything, so... Seems like the game still is holding us by the hand. Uh, I guess the time has come to go for... Is there more to the map? Where is this? Why can I not see where this is? Oh, whatever, let's go. There are fragments on Dandy's lost aircraft out in the Bramble Hollow somewhere. Oh, this is the Bramble Hollow. Okay, somewhere it says. Yeah, let's go wherever. What, what do we have least of? Let's go whatever we have least of. So, uh... I guess we have Blossom Shimmers and Placid. Yeah, let's go with whatever has Howls, okay? So this one. Um, one reset, what does that mean? By default, him, her, he, him, okay. Uh, let's, you know what, let's keep this. And this time, remember for once to use the Arrow Flurry. Please, Sift, no bonus, okay. So the bonus is only new stuff. This is new, so this gives bonus. This is new, so this gives bonus. Oh, it's a one-time bonus on something you have never used. Okay, got it. Uh, I could go for the retaliate build, or I could go for the slash build. You know what? Let's go for the slash build, now that, that we have it. Especially because this whole thing might be good with Jack Will. Because Jack Will should most likely break a bunch of stuff. I don't know. Let's try. What is this? One bonus action. Is that a good idea for this? Uh, essence, the classic move. Purse's course on purse halves, core health, gain two health. Do one damage on bounce, on core bounce, add seven scar. Scar makes it so that enemies don't regrow. And uh, shatter six, stop. Shatter six and stop. Shatter is, it does damage and spreads it. So this is pretty much a break everything. Yeah, let's go with this. This is bonus tiles are random. No, no. Gain one action when you damage this tile. Okay, I can definitely damage tiles with the shear. So, and uh, I would say uh, this gives 20 energy. Yeah, let's swap it. I have an idea. This gives me ch 20 charge when I damage this tile and this thing costs 20 energy. So theoretically speaking, I could use this move to break the tile for free. Yeah, break the tile for free. The end. <laughs> Nothing more to explain. <laughs> okay. Um, first things first. He, he wants to tell me something. What is it, Jack Will? Ah, take a whiff of that fresh air. There's nothing like wandering out through the hollow. You know, those brambles over overhead may be mostly thorns nowadays, but folks say the leaves used to glitter so thick with moats they'd put the stars to shame. Oh, Skipper doesn't talk a lot. What? You don't be leafing me? Ha <laughs> ha! Um, off you get sent to the other side of the field for that, what you said. I like how there's like an animation and he didn't ever... Let's go here. Let's go here to explore these two. Okay. Uh, makes them more powerful. I could fight the beast right now. What is, by the way? Shard. Shard breaches has weak scales. Okay. I definitely want to go with some explosive materials there. Uh, let's go here. Maybe find something. 
Machine rate. What is this? Why is it? Oh, found a caravan debris. A clue. Perfect. Shattered. Shattered propeller. What is this? Of the end is missing arrow card. Has to be. Then we moved. So if I go here, the enemy is gonna go here. Yeah, let's let's just let the enemy get a pool. With us getting the explosive. Now the enemy is gonna get a pool. And it got more attack and more level. So it didn't get more growth rum. Let's fight. Let's bring it on. Let's bring it on. I had some... No, I didn't really have time. Oh. Yeah. Oh, this is not a good enemy. This is not a good enemy. Um, I mean, I knew that it was this one. <laughs> I don't know why I didn't think about it. I guess let's go off to the sunset. Boom. Boom. Bop, bop, bop. Nope. Didn't get it. Didn't hit it. Let's try to get the strike and maybe turn around. Yeah, this should be enough. If it doesn't hit here, it did hit there. Tonk, 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 tonk. Oh, 18 energy. Didn't get my 20 energy from that. Why? Oh, here. This time we are close enough, though. We should be getting this. Whoop. 20 charge. I can definitely use one of my skills. Um, Rupture. She has 6 growth. So right now I definitely don't want to do shear. I would like to go some of those. On bounce, did 1 damage. On core bounce, 7 scar. Can I hit a core? I can't really hit a core, to be honest. Mm, let's try to break this to maybe reset the rampage in a bit. So, theoretically, if I shoot here, I should do hit, dung, ding, back, bing bong, back again. Let's hope for the best. Whoop, beep, beep. Exactly. No! It was close enough, though. Whoop, we got hit. He got hit. Maybe I should just summon him. Oh, he's also resetting the rampage. Yeah, I should summon him only when I really, really need to reset the rampage. I could... Okay, now I could do the shear. This is only for... Does one damage to per scale up to... Okay, this is not gonna change. Man, he has very bad scales for this move. Rapture. I can do rapture on this. This, this shows me that I'm hitting it, right? So I'm hitting it. It's gonna get seven scars. And uh, let's hope for the best. Seven scars. At 15 scars, it activates. The beast will not, not regrowth. But right now, it has minus three, right? Current effect, the growth of the beast is decreased by three. Hmm, maybe I'm not understanding this correctly. It's going to kill. So let's rapture it. And then I will try to run away. It should give us a downward corner. A nice. Didn't hit anything, though. I don't think I can gather those up. Back into round H4. Growth is 8. Let's start bashing around. Maybe I can get that in the very back. Nope. Okay, let's try to go in there again. Boop, 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 boop. Don't go to the damaging area. Thank you, I got a tangle. 35 energy. Okay, let's, let's try shear here. So theoretically it should hit this, and then this, this, and this, and this. And uh, on core bound stop. And then it should jump over there, hit this, this should chain around, and then I will stop somewhere. Whoop. Why did this not break? Why did all this not break? I don't know why all that didn't break. Let's go for Rapture here. Try to also hit this thing. We got it. Nice, this got Raptured, so he's guard right now. Fading. I thought this permanent effect, the growth of the beast is decreased by 3. While scarred, the beast will not regrow scales. So right now it's not regrowing scales at all. At least that's what it should do. Go here. Hit this. In two times. Oh, right now it's about to rampage on the next turn. Let's go in that corner and hopefully not get over there. Wow, almost got over there. Okay, it's still scarred. It's not scarred anymore. Uh, and it... Oh, it didn't regen. All of that is broken. I could go for another rupture. You know what? Time for this guy because I'm going to lose otherwise. I want to see this happen. Each companion stops the beast from rampaging. Once their uh, battle ability allow flurry. Let's do it. Do it. Arrow flurry. Uh, is this happening on its own? Has to happen on its own, I hope. Shatter. Uh, not sure I want to shatter, to be honest. I'm also not sure I want to rapture, to be again honest. I want to skewer, but skewer is not going to kill anything. 
Let's hope we can somehow kill these, or either of those. Okay, we're not really safe here. Did I rapture a scar? I mean, it moves forward, that's the problem. Let's try to scar. Okay, scarred. But I'm, I'm losing, right? Rampage, imminent. Can I now use him? Doesn't look like it. So at least the enemy cannot really heal. Let's go here. Boop. I missed. Nice, nice. Okay, rampage reset. Nice. I see items there that I care about. So I guess we go here, pick those up, and maybe kill this thing too. Got it. And now I should bounce over there. Got it. Nice, nice, nice. You attack. I'm gonna pick all that up. Its growth is at almost zero. Let's try to pick those things up. Okay, these are pretty much unpickable. Stewer, no. Uh, on Pierce. Pierce's course. It only Pierce's course. And this uh, on core bounce does the scar. Otherwise, it doesn't do anything. We can do this, and hopefully, it goes in there and does like ding, 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 and destroys it. Yeah, with 80 move, that's the only thing I can do. This is shatter. This is 40 moves. Yeah, this is not a lot. And it's all it's gonna pierce and then go in there. Let's go with the strike and hope for the ding ding dings. The farther up the better. Yeah. Perfect. As planned. I'm gonna get hit. It's okay. Okay, he starts healing again. It's maybe ding 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 over there. I, I will lose all those because he's exactly on them. And I can't really do anything there. And uh, I guess shear. No, I could shear this. Or I could do just rapture. I can hit him. I think I should scar so that it doesn't heal. Nice, scarred. Almost scarred again. The, these are all gonna go away and I can't pick them up. I mean, I have no choice in the matter. Uh, let's let's do this. It's gonna break all of them. And then I also, it's gonna also gonna break those. Whoop, 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 whoop. Very nice, very nice. I can scar him even more. He's scarred again. So he's not healing. As long as he's not healing, we are good. We are good. Mm, let's try to get the good corner hit in here. Decent. Let's try to get another good one. Uh, I'm trying to hit with this corner, hit this one, and then hopefully get rolled back. It should be here. Perfect. Perfect. Rampaging 2. Companion still hasn't used its move. Enemy is still scarred. Uh, I would say scar again. Can I get in there? Looks like it. Super scarred. Super scarred. You're never healing, man. You're never healing. Let's try to get the energy for once. Got it. Almost got hit. Almost died, by the way. Rampage imminent. Okay, I hope the companion's gonna trigger itself. Otherwise, we will most likely lose here. Try to hit this thing like twice or three times. Or one. Or one. You know. And uh, yeah, if this is not gonna hit him twice, I'm, I'm done. Most likely. Boop. Boop. Yep. We're done. Or we will see what he does. I wanna see how this works. Let's put a bow on this. Almost nothing. Nothing at all. Yeah. I love you, man. I think I got the point. No, you did not go in the point. I think I got the point. Is this a reference to to Prosty? How was he called? Prosty? Prosty? Um, I don't remember how he's called. It was like a YouTuber who had like <laughs> King uh, King Dragon sends his regards or whatever. Uh, let's Rapture. I would like to get this energy. <laughs> let's try to get in there. Not almost, almost. Oh, the only thing that did not get hit was the energy man. Skewer, the time has come. Let's see if this thing actually wants, uh, does uh, rounding upwards. Whoop, whoop. It does not do rounding upwards. But I did get healed. And now he's gonna start healing. He's not uh, ruptured anymore. 
Oh, he healed one. Yeah, very nice. Let's go in there and destroy him. Okay, I have to say, this sword is not fun. Uh, because, because the only reason, the only reason I say that, it, it's only one reason, is because the, the skewer, skewer is non-lethal. If skewer was lethal, then I could, I would say, okay. That's the only reason I didn't like the weapon. Because these things, making the enemy not be able to regenerate, were fun. This, these two mechanics were fun. This thing, useless. So the good move was useless, but you can heal at least. I mean, let's try the next weapon. I only found one clue. Why, Madame Whiskersmith? This tea is delightful. Thank you, Lord Dundee. Uh, though it probably doesn't suit your refined taste. Nonsense. I find it endearingly rustic. Rustic? <laughs> Just like this fascinating manual kettle technology. <laughs> Oscar, you returned. Oh, 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 it appears you have found a propeller from my lost aero cart. My father would be even ever so relieved. If we could but reclaim the caravan missing cargo for future use. Or at the very least to our uh, file an insurance claim. <laughs> okay. Kitchen. Okay. Is there something to craft? No. Let's go off to the next area then. Um, let's uh, let's continue gathering the same. Actually, let's go to the other one. Let's go to Task Crawler this time. And uh, let's obviously use the new weapon. Which is uh, Taunt. Taunt means while it's while the taunt bar is filled, permanent effect the ram of the beast is increased by one, and while it's filled, it's also the rampage counter doesn't go down. So uh, you're making the boss uh, rampage as slow as possible. Also does two damage on taunt bounce. This thing on the first bounce deals three damage. So that's it. You gain six block and three damage. That's it. That's the classic sword attack and retaliate. Well, when the beast lands an attack on you, deal damage equal to its attack to the attacking core. Fading. At the start of your turn, lose one retaliate. So you can do this twice to have it for two turns. At this cost 25. So... You're supposed to just spam taunt. And uh, at some point retaliate, I guess. And some blocks here and there. I mean, these things don't cost that much. Yeah, let's go. Uh, as for... Yeah, I'm gonna use this. As for... Coat... Let's go with the max HP here in the charge gain. And uh, let's not use Jackwill again, because we just saw his ability. Let's go with Poppy throws healing creeds onto the field for you. Because <laughs> I might die. Uh, the tracking ability might not help us for the... You know, for the purpose of finding stuff. But uh, it's okay, let's go here. That was most likely not a good move. Okay, let's go here. Let's go here. Let's go here. This should be the last one. Okay, now I think this. Uh, we get this. Oh, Poppy wants to sell something. Another propeller! Absorb growth. Okay, growth is okay. What do you want to tell us? Poppy, how's the responsible elder Whiskersmith cousin? I gotta say, what took you so long? There is a skip. It's gonna be so fun to have you actually running around with me for once. I can't believe it. My bouncing baby cousin, all grown up and following in my paw straps by totally bailing on their chores. Yeah, so off you go for a GDs. You know, wait, did she not? What? What is her ability? What? Isn't her ability supposed to pick up what's there and there around stuff? Whatever. Shards. Uh, yeah, again, the shard beast. So off we go back. Create an explosive. And uh, yeah, I guess we fight. Let's bring it on. Bring it on. Bring it on, sword. Okay, we got the classic gold one. A very easy, accessible 20 energy here. Off we go. Boop, boop, boop. And we hit him a bit. Now I can go bounce and deal 3 damage. Retaliate is pretty useless. So... It's only on the first bounce, right? On the first bounce. Yeah, then just do this. We got 6 armor and we just do damage. That's it. Oh, it's... 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 It's ready. Okay, another 20 energy. Whoop. Not energy. Charge. 47. I can go with enrage. Deal 2 damage on bounce. And on core bounce, I taunt... If this is the first bounce, increase attack by 2. So 
So the idea is to make the enemy have a lot of attack and then just retaliate once and win. Okay, let's go with this. I mean, I can definitely not hit a core with this right now. So I only have one action point. Yeah, I'm not going to hit a core with this right now. Let's go with Seal of Nerves then. Let's, uh, yeah, let's just do that. That was a mistake. <laughs> that was definitely a mistake. Growth 12. Okay, I'm never breaking anything, it seems. Let's, uh, let's somehow damage this area, I guess. Okay, off we went to the sunset. Let's, uh, is there any reason to try to get that? Can I somehow get in there? I guess this should hit something. Nope, I wasted 40, 35 energy for nothing. I should have gone with steel, steel of ner Nerves of Steel. Let's try to maybe break that thing. Almost, I guess. Uh, let's try to hit this. Nice. I need to break at one right now. I don't want to waste Poppy right away. Okay, now I can do Enrage though. And I can break this as this does two damage. Boop. And also add the taunt, right? Okay, it added the taunt. Very nice. So now I need to taunt him another three times. And he has 11 attack. If I if I bring the, the main core down to low, an, low amount of life. Stay the bottom. Nice. If I make the core, core one have uh, 11 life right now, it's instantly a win. I would say steal of nerves just to pick up. I'm not going to be able to pick up the energy. This is on the first bounce. Yep, that's not happening. Enrage is also not happening. Is it? Could I not do enrage here? It should bounce back and hit the four, right? It should bounce back and hit the four. Please don't go sideways. Please don't go sideways. Yes, perfect. And I even got the energy. Very nice. Taunt hit. And, uh... I guess let's try to get this and hit the core. And the more damage I do to the main core, the easier it's going to be for the retaliate one shot. Okay, I have 12 shield. So I think it's time. He's attacking for 11. So I think I'm, I would like to go retaliate. So first turn, I'm going to pretty much do almost nothing. Actually, not nothing. Why nothing? Here, do 3 damage to him. Whoop. Now I can do retaliate. Does this damage at all? No, it just moves. It just moves you into the area. Come on, let's let me show it to me. Boom, 11 damage. Yep, it works exactly as I hoped it would. Let's try to hit this. Nice, got it randomly, obviously. Let's go for an enraged taunt or whatever. Is that a good idea? I don't have a good angle here. Actually, do I have enough life? Yeah, we won. We won. Whoop, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, boom, dead. I like the sword. I like the sword. You don't even need to play with the taunt at all. The taunt is only helping you by time. But normally speaking, you can just block, 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 retaliate, retaliate, done. Maybe it doesn't work if the enemy core doesn't actually attack. I still don't know what Renown does. We got one of those. On a clue. Yeehaw! Okay, we, uh, we have some time. Oh ho! So you've been <laughs> ho ho. This guy, this, he's gonna be the ho ho guy. Ho ho! You've been brewing the tea for the very clover blossom. You grow right here. What a clever idea! Yes, that's farming. <laughs> She's gonna be my heavy voice. Skipper, you found more remnants from the caravan. This bodes well. Well, well. Ho ho! <laughs> from this, perhaps that most knowledgeable Jockwell can determine the uh, arrow card's location. Yeah, I mean, he's a scout and all. Craft? Nope. Uh, off we go to the expedition. And uh, what do we have as a choice? Yeah, search through the Bamble Hall to find Dandy's lost hero card. We can do this. Leroy and uh, Jackwell has advised me that my missing cargo is likely to be in the Brambles near Whispergrove Keep. I do hope the urn is intact for us to uncover. I should like to possibly use it in order to... Aha! But I'm getting ahead of myself. Let us not count our eggs before they have hatched. Or, or cargo before it, see if it has. Or been smashed into a million pieces. Why though? Why? Some random thing. Okay, because... Um, because he's the hammer guy, we go with the hammer. And I also like the hammer, by the way. And uh, let's go with Sandal Smith here, as this is pretty much the hammer item. 
and uh, off we go. Maybe I should go with another retaliate. You know what? Yeah, I want to do another retaliate. Beast somewhere. I shall be focusing on my attention on recovering the tech. So when we encounter the beast, would you be so good as uh, I'll stop it? Mm, should I should I go back and try the retaliate sword again? I want to try the retaliate sword again. You know, uh, yeah, that's a bottom expedition. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't think anything negative happens, right? As far as I know, uh, the game is pretty much do what you want. Lord Dandelion. Just dandy. I insist. Lord Dandelion is my father. Also my grandfather and my great-great-grandfather. Dandy. What are you doing with my laundry hamper? Ah, my father always says we should never shy away from assisting those in need. Besides, I'm quite eager to experience this fine peasant art for myself. Yes! Peasant art! Laundrying! A noble doing laundry doesn't seem right. Do you use gadgets for that? But of course. And I shall happy acquire some household pins for you if you like. Oh my, that's not... Speaking of pins, my good lady, come closer, that we might take a selfie together. What, with our dirty laundry? What if someone like Queen sees it? Oddly, why the Queen is far too ex reclusive for that sort of thing, one can simply ring her up. That's a relief. No, this will merely be viewed. This will merely be viewed by the lofted court and perhaps the upper echelons of the parliament. I'm taking the hamper. Okay, um, yeah, I mean, let's do this again, but this time with uh, with with the sword we just used, because I'm not going to use the sword that much, and I'm definitely going to spam the hammer whenever I find a chance. So, uh, for now, let's use this repost weapon just for a bit. Oh, there isn't even a chat, very nice. Someone rated you settlement. Okay, this is the free settlement thing. Uh, I don't want to do a mega scout. You know what? I don't want to use this because this is literally wasting a move. I want to just YOLO into an area. Exactly. And try to open up stuff. And I can move here. There's no reason to. Nice. Uh oh. The beast! And also, I'm missing arrow card. Aha! The urn still has all its spinny bits intact. Although its paint does appear to be chipped, which may hurt the appraisal of Earthquake. Shh. Oh, hey, what? Shh. What is shh? What is shh? Mm, okay, the arrow card is on the beast, I guess. The beast is forge. Forge beasts have stronger scales. More barriers. Let's go here. I want a seven, and then I'm off to off to fight him. Okay, that's a three, by the way. Uh, it's more leveled. It's about to guess either decreased run, which is really bad, or increased attack. Increased attack is good, but I think this is forced. So let's go here. Let's take this. You can take that. I can farm up a bit then. I wanted to get more attack. Oh no, it's next to the settlement, man. Okay, this is free. This should be free, right? Um, let's go with... Let's go with uh, acid to get rid of them. Acid 2 should remove most of them. So craft this. Let's go with health because I'm gonna tank my life away. That's it, pretty much. Okay, and now we attack before it gets the settlement for free. And I let it get more attack because I want to retaliate for more damage. Okay, we got it over there right away. Very nice. We got our energy, easy to pick up. So let's try to maybe bounce somewhere useful. There is nothing useful here. It would be nice if they remove this UI when... Uh, Oh, oh! this is almost outside of the field. Ah, this is the arena. Got it. That's why this is so weird. Angling. Here we go. Off we go over there. Whoa, boom. Very nice. Everything got poisoned over there. These should all pop. I would obviously start going with that. And I say obviously, yeah. And let's explode this thing. Too. Boom. Exploded it and we got X6 shield. Very nice. This was a good round for us. Pass. I have to pass now every turn by hand, a turn by hand because I have the... Um, healing potion there and the game doesn't know when I want to use the healing potion if I want to use the healing potion or not uh, you're doing 13 damage and you have 12 life I can retaliate and win right away but let's not play let's not play dangerously let's play as safe as possible let's go into there for damage up, 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 up. okay Let's go steal of nerves. Maybe I can hit this. I think this is hitting what I want, not this one. Here. No. 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 I think this hits what I want. 
Got it. And pass. And from the next town on, turn on, because you have 8 attack. And I have 12 shield. I can go with a retaliate. I'm not sure what the retaliate is gonna hit exactly, though. Really not sure. Let's go with a poison there, and maybe a poison here. Nice, nice. Those things are all gonna break at the end of the next turn. And, uh... Should I, should I do this? Should I enrage the beast? Is there any real reason for doing that? I wanna, I wanna retaliate and see what happens. So let's come here, and hopefully it's gonna break this. I don't know how exactly retaliate's gonna work right now. Boop. Yeah, it hits whatever hits me. Boop, bye. Five damage. Insta kill, man. Eight damage. Eight damage on a piece. Yeah, but what's, what's now gonna get attacked? Everything broke. Now I play. That's my turn. In we go. In we go. Boop, boop. Two damage. Poison that thing, so that's gonna break. I guess steal of nerves, just so that we don't get hit. And also, maybe it's gonna hit it, maybe it's not. I'm gonna bet that it's not gonna hit it. I'm just moving my mouse ever so slightly. Actually, the further away I am, the more it should not move. Come on, come on, come on. Let's hope it hits. It didn't hit. It's okay. And turn. Pretty sure the body cannot attack us. Is the body? Is this attack a body attack? Is this a win? Mm, I guess let's try to go in there. Actually, is there any reason to mega poison the whole area? I don't think there is. I think this is safer. Because it's gonna hit here and then go over there. Exactly, that's better. I have 18 shield, he does 8 damage. So, no, I want to try retaliate. No! Uh, I guess let's bounce around. Let's try to go in there. Why not? Poison everything, so we have a turn of free damage. Okay, now I have a lot of life. Pass. Oh, it was a... Okay, it was an attack from the tail. Is this an attack from the body? This looks like a body attack. To me, at least. Let's go with Stealth of Neve. Uh, Nerves of Steel. Just bounce the 3 damage. Yeah, it's gonna go in there and do 3 damage. Wait, wait, wait. Do I have enough energy? Yes, I have. Let's go in here. No, it's okay. Retaliate. And hopefully this is an insta-kill on the body. Let's see how this works. Pass. Yep, insta-kill on the body. Yes! Retaliate is broken! This weapon is broken! I think I think I found an even better weapon. I think I found an even better weapon than the hammer. I like I like the fact that we have good weapons. I'm I'm super excited about really strong beasts. I'm excited. I, I really like the games that give you very powerful stuff and give you also very powerful enemies. I don't like the games that make you be very weak yourself so that the game is a struggle like um, Dark Souls or whatever. I want to have really... I want to be powerful and I want the enemies to also be powerful. I prefer that play of, uh, way of playing. Danny, it appears that this... Um, it appears that Urn can still function, but as I feared, the aesthetics are terribly damaged. I confess this may. I, I'm trying to make him into a noble. I'm I'm I'm, I'm trying to find the, 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 the voice. For I hoped well to bequeath it to the forge to convey my gratitude of your hospitality. <clears throat> what? That is uh this must be worth more than the whole fire farm. Oh yes, without a doubt. It can enchant with two sparks, after all. Enhance? It can enhance with two sparks. Enchant? Enchant with two sparks? Enhant with two sparks? I, again, don't understand how this fits into this sentence. Uh, but look, how unsightly it has become is even still worth giving. A few, uh, a few dentists don't make something worthless. A few dents don't make something worthless. So roll up your sleeves, Skipper. Daddy, start up the contraption. We're upgrading the forge. Oh, now we will get access to more weapons. That should do it, Skipper. Forging with two sparks creates new individual weapon parts. Individual weapon parts, nice. You can then combine those parts into a unique customized weapon. Oh, love it, love it. Just how me and Nettle used to do it when we were forging together. I love it. Two spark crafting unlocked. Skipper! S Skipper! It's an emergency. Oh, well, I attempted to help with laundry for your grandmother. But of all but all of it had turned pink. How could this occur? Not that pink <clears throat> Not that pink is normally a fetched shade, but oh whatever should I do? 
<laughs> I'm not talking. Um, this is no laughing matter. Your grandmother has done a great deed for me, housing me here, and I was seeking to repay it. But I've made a mess of it. A truly noble who would make amends. Perhaps I should commission her an entire new wardrobe or finest of finest silk. Yes, with silver embroidery. I don't. Uh, I. I don't think. Uh Homeskipper, a commemorate selfie to show that we have triumphed over this obstacle. Is there like somewhere a, a selfie stuff? Okay, I'm not gonna speak here because it's most likely gonna go the story onwards and uh, I think I, I would like to cut it off here. I want to keep this short. Wow. Wow. Okay. What do I have infinite of these two? Big hammer, hammer spin. Unlock new hammerhead. Okay. And what else do I have a lot of? I guess... Uh, yeah, these. Unlock new hammer haft. Momentum. And uh, concussive blow. Stop on the second bounce. Reverb 2. One reverb for Shinesha. Deal X damage to targets and tile adjacent tiles. Wait, what? X damage to target tile and all adjacent tiles. Stop on the second bounce. On stop. Reverb 2. Okay, momentum, gain one charge, one charge for inertia, splash five spawns, X small project. Wait, this is the normal hammer I have. Can I can I somehow check how this works? I guess I have to go in the fight to see how this works. Check crafted. Wait, where are the hammers? Oh, 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 oh. I somehow went ahead and crafted the exact same thing I have. Yes. Yeah, well, tomorrow we will be crafting. Let's do all of that tomorrow. You know, first thing, tomorrow. We will be crafting. We will create our unique uh, rare weapons, custom weapons or whatever. And uh, yeah, I mean, uh, I'm ready to... I don't know exactly what I want to create. I want to create a sword. This sword. I want to create this thing. So the same shield, but with a different uh, secondary ability over here. That's it pretty much. Um, so yeah, I mean, uh, that's going to be it. I'm really excited about maybe seeing... What is this? This is like for a bow to arrows. So that's the bottom part. And this is the bow and the the filler. So this the the shoot the shot, I guess. Okay, I get it. So these are the secondary parts. The, uh, these are the first parts. And how I understand it is these upgrades are going to be these two weapons I already have. Uh, most likely. Because they happen to be them. But these are most likely new ones. Because this seems to be a, like a rare resource. Because I have less of it. Over here. Yeah, I mean, I see four and I have four. So I'm pretty sure I'm not even going to cover everything. And uh, then over here. There is crafting to be done. I mean, I have to choose one at random. Yeah, tomorrow. Tomorrow. Everything is going to happen tomorrow. And the first thing I'm going to do is most likely do the... The... What's it called? The breastplate or whatever those things are called. The mantles or the tunics or the mail plates. Yeah, because by seeing what I get, I can decide then which weapon I should create. And yeah, that's going to be it for today. So if you want to make amends like uh, Dandy wants to do for the team, you could drop a like, maybe helping out the channel. I mean, look at this guy. He's full of hearts mm -hmm. and I can give you a heart. Yeah. If, oh, no, no. You can drop a like just for that. And if you want to comment something, then I can give you a heart <laughs> because I'm reading every single comment and I'm dropping hearts for whatever I read. So that's what I mean. If you want to tell me something like, uh, I don't know, uh, like how awesome and broken retaliate is or uh, how fun... Um, what else did we do today? Oh, not so fun the weapon that Persis does? Or how awesome the move that over here my boy... What was his call? What was his name? Yeah, or if you remember what his name is. I, I remember his name, by the way. So yeah, if you remember what his name is, or if you want to tell me how awesome his power was. I didn't use the dandy's power. So, I haven't seen his power yet in the combat, but his power was awesome, although it was not used in a good way, <laughs> but it was fun. So, yeah, comment about anything and everything you would like me to know, and uh, yeah, that's going to be it pretty much. If you want to support me even more, there is a whole patron for that, but uh, I mean, you're not forced to, so do as you wish. Thank you for watching. See you guys around.